Hey guys, it's Jeff again. Uh, I want to go across my cancer story. Uh, last year around July, well, a couple months before July, I found out that I had cancer, a melanoma spot on my shoulder, and the surgeon recommended that I get surgery. If not, I probably would only live three or four years without surgery because uh, the uh, cancer had seeped down into my lymph nodes underneath my arm right here. So, uh, he's, after the surgery, he strongly recommended I do a treatment and all the treatments that were available are kind of sketchy. Um, so I did some research myself and I found out that THC oil stops hormones in the cancer cells so that the cancer cells can't reproduce and make more cancer. So, uh, I started taking oil and at first I could only take 30 to 40 milligrams uh, a day. I was kind of anxious and kind of sketched out, but uh, supposedly you have to have a really high dose for it to be effective. So you have to be pretty stoned out on the stuff. At the end there, you know, about six or eight months later, I had taken 60 to 80 grams of oil, uh, eaten and I was at about 100 to 150 milligrams at the end there and also when you're on oil it somehow helps to spot narcissism which is off topic completely but previously I didn't realize I was being emotionally charged with negative energy or I didn't realize people were stealing my good energy and flipping flopping me for bad energy which is kind of tricky but when you're really stoned on THC oil somehow you're just like get off me <laughs> like I can feel your pressure so bad right now so uh, it really helps also uh, there's something called autophagy which cleans all the cells in the body and you cannot okay so if you're eating sugar or meat or dairy it lowers, it's very acidic and it lowers the chances of having autophagy. It stops autophagy. The, I'll get into it in a different video. I made a big, uh, wrote a nice paper on autophagy and fasting and all that. So, uh, I'm not recommending that you go get super stoned on THC oil, but I recently last month got a PET scan and I didn't have any cancer left in me. So, I feel like it was successful and I've changed my life, my belief system and all that. So here I am making videos and I was scared to go outside of the house before. So, you know, so far so good. Wish me luck. Thanks. Bye.